like I said before my little intro, is that I ended up back in Facebook jail. <clears throat> After my entire account had been, so I thought, taken off of warning status when Facebook went down. But apparently they remembered one comment that I had made, whatever. It was literally almost a year ago. My account got restricted. I'm coming up on the 24 hour mark now. And Facebook said that I violated their uh, community standards. Well, how they said that I violated the community standards was I made terroristic threats on somebody's life. Now hear me out. I didn't make a terroristic threat on somebody's life. My only comment was, yes, just kill him already. It wasn't, it wasn't even for a normal, like it wasn't even for a real person. So, once again, Facebook is fucking around with people. Facebook is screwing around with people. Instead of reading the whole post, instead of just the comment, my account wouldn't be on restricted right now. Because, and like I posted to the oversight board was that if the entire post and other comments on that same post were completely read instead of the algorithm just reading the comment, then there would have been no need for my account to be restricted because I didn't make a terroristic threat on a non-fictional person's life. I made a terror well it wasn't necessarily a terroristic threat it was more or less more or less a they just need to kill off a character and find something new to film well the non-fictional character that I quote unquote Facebook labeled me as I made a terroristic threat on somebody's life was Michael Myers. Because I watched the new Halloween movie, I streamed it on Peacock, Peacock TV, because apparently on that app it's free and I don't pay for that app. Spoiler alert for those who wanna see the movie is he doesn't die. He literally gets right back up, puts his mask back on, and literally takes out the entire town around him with just a knife. So, me going to Facebook jail over me saying that they just need to kill him already, Facebook completely took my comment out of context. And Facebook wonders why people are leaving their platform on a daily basis on, in the thousands. Because their comments get taken out of context. And Facebook doesn't care. They're trying to make it a safe, happy, snowflake-filled place. Algorithm 
took a comment from a, an entire post out of context. So, if anybody watching this, if you still have Facebook, watch what you say. Because they even threatened to call law enforcement, local law enforcement on me, for terroristic threats against someone's life or violence towards someone when that someone is a non-fictional character in a movie. Like, that completely fucking irks my nerves. But I've been waiting, because if they call law enforcement and say that I made a terroristic threat on somebody's life, or incited violence on somebody... When the cops show up, I'm going to straight up tell them, here, look at the Facebook post. So somebody from Facebook called y'all, said such and such. I'm going to be like, Facebook just wasted y'all's time. Y'all could be doing something else other than coming to me, trying to arrest me for saying something that is technically defamation of character. Because I didn't make a terroristic threat on somebody's life. And I sure as hell didn't incite an act of violence against somebody real. I would never do that. Almost out of juice. On my way to get some more juice. You know, this kind of juice. Also to get me something to eat because I'm going on, what time is it, it's four, four o'clock, I'm going on 27 hours of not eating, so this time yesterday, last time, or I ate this time yesterday, well, no, hold on, when did I go to lunch yesterday, 24, 25, 26, 27, no, I'm going on 28 hours. Since I ate last. There's balls in here. I shouldn't have worn this hoodie. I don't know if that mattered or not. This cars with electronic steering still need alignments. Mr. Everett, chill out. Thank you. Go to the interstate, or do I want to go through town? Or I could just go down the bypass. Yeesh. That's a hard one. Fuck it. I'll go through downtown and. sights on McDonald's or Little Caesars because they're both right there. Ooh, but I could go to Arby's. Nah. If I go to Little Caesars, I can turn my calorie deficit around. Rather, if I go to McDonald's, I'm only really gonna eat like McChicken's add pickle. Yeah, because I'm weird. Decisions, decisions.
that actually felt good. And it's 55 and I'm going 57. But anyways, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, hit the bell notification icon, turn the notifications to all, and comment down below.